Lizzie Bird, welcome back to Mario Kart Wii. Today, we are hopping back into one for the CC, this time starting off with the Retro Cups. Of course, we got through all the basic cups last time around with Baby Mario and Baby Peach, but now it's time to hop in with a different character and see how things go with the Retro. Over here, we have Toad. <laughs> and that's exactly who we'll be playing today. We should start with the Standard Kart S, but then we'll change to something we haven't played just yet. That should be a lot of fun, but for right now, Time for Toad. We got Manual, Drifting, and right down here, the Shell Cup, which has Peach Beach, Yoshi Falls, Ghost Valley 2, and Mario Raceway. So Peach Beach is probably the longest track out of this cup, I think. The other ones we should be able to boost through pretty fast. But I guess we'll see here in just a moment. Peach Beach is a lot of fun as well. We got all the Delfinos cheering us on, or the Piantas. They're from Delfino, but they're they're Piantas, right? Something like that. They are racing this Toad. Classic Mario Kart character has been here since the beginning. Always cool to see. Especially since we've been playing some newer Mario Kart characters here recently. The go back to a classic character is always fun. Oh, and we get the golden mushroom to start things off, so I really want to use that to boost through all this. And definitely steal a really solid first place, but then it immediately gets taken from the, the flippers, whatever they're called. Not good. It's okay. We'll go ahead and grab one of these, and I get a banana out of it. Nothing too exciting, huh? That's okay. We're cruising out here in second. Wario is the contender in front of us. I'm just going to try to catch up to you. Pull off the best drifts that I can. Let's see if we can't. Uh, Get a lead build up now that Wario's falling back a bit more. Got it. <laughs> this guy starts here and be coming from a mile away. Tries to run into my path here, but we're fine. I throw out a banana. I grab another item. And we get yet another banana. This part's just sort of a bit of a straightaway. Not too much I can do about it, but I'll just keep drifting here. Ah, not good. Come on, Ted. I got this red shell here. Just gotta keep moving. Nice. Here comes some more of the flippers, though. It's usually the purple one that gives me a lot of issues. Uh, come on, come on. I got through it. We have an okay lead. If I can just get a good drift here, put down this fake question block among all the moving ones. Not the pal block. Oh, there was a superstar there I could have snagged. Oh, oh, hey, 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 you get back here, princess. <laughs> All right, well, Princess's loyal servant, Toad, was willing to uh, take the, the loss on that one, <laughs> I guess. A little unfortunate, but hey, it might be a rough start. We'll bounce back here in the next one. So Yoshi Falls is our next track. This track is super duper quick. Um, hopefully it'll be a quick win this time, not a quick second place. We'll have to wait and see. Man, I wish I would have driven into that star before. <laughs> That's gonna be on my mind all day. Okay. Let's see what we wanna do. Uh, miss an item to start things off. But you know, who needs items when I got good drifts? Catching up the peach a little bit. Seems like she's gonna be our main competition for this cut. I didn't mean to throw that out like that, but maybe it'll hit somebody, maybe it'll hit me. Oh, dodging a lot of green shells here, scary. But I make it up the other side, at the end of this lap, first place. Let's see if we can keep that. This time I get the item. Triple banana as well, so that's good. Keeping myself pretty protected. Oh, got it. Okay. Hitting the railing here isn't so good, but overall we handled that. Maybe I can throw out a banana or two around just to make this a bit more difficult because that was gonna happen anyways. Okay, it's the final lap. We have a little bit of a lead. If we could just continue to drift. Got it, that was pretty good. Don't fly off onto the railing this time. Much better. And then with this last turn, I get that one speed boost. Things are looking good here. I throw out all the items I can, but boom, we get the solid win. So much better for Toad here. We get the 15 points. We were a good couple seconds ahead of the competition too. 
Much better, much better for sure. Let's go to the next one. So Ghost Valley 2 is our next race here. Boos are laughing. They got some evil schemes up ahead, I'm sure. But we can handle it. Ooh, got a good start and everything. So if we can just make the drifts work. I'll hold out the green Koopa shell. Oh man. They are all out here trying to get me. All these boos. I mean, they sort of just fly around. I can sort of feel like they're gonna like swoop in and steal my item just because I'm used to that from other Mario games. But I guess it doesn't really happen like that in this one. Got it. I'm gonna throw this back and then just keep drifting, keep driving. Let's see if I can't get, yeah, there we go, a red drift there. We're handling it very well so far and I want it to stay that way. I feel like the jump there sort of ruins my speed in some ways. Maybe not worth actually grabbing. Good enough. Okay, we're really zooming through this but they are catching up quite well. But if I could just, whoa, you almost got me with that one. That would have been bad, but we get through it. Toad's the winner. Such a fast track. And with it, as you can see, we're able to get 15 more points. Peach falling behind with some points. So we made something happen. Let's move to the next race. So N64 Mario Raceway, such a fun track for sure. This one might actually be longer than the uh, the first track of this, the, uh, the Peach Beach. Hard to say, but they're both definitely the longer tracks of this cup. But I think Toad could handle this one. Nice, going right into a big drift. Definitely want to get a win here. Dry Bone's giving us a lot of competition today, too. Ah, I took that drift a little bit wrong. Oh, gotcha. Okay, Peach is our main competition, so knocking her out with an item is definitely a big deal. Get the triple green shell now. We're forced to be reckoned with. Don't even try that. She keeps trying to snipe me with the, uh, with the question blocks, and I'm just not having it. Okay, yeah, no, I don't like this one. Here, try to hit Diddy. No, okay, I didn't hit Diddy. I wonder if I have like better acceleration or something. Can I, can you get over here? <laughs> Come on, he's just slipping, sliding all over the place to get away from me. Now I'm shrunken down. It's not a good situation. Anybody can ride over here to squish me, and that's just really, really dangerous. So, I don't get any item out of that one. No, come on, darn. Back to sixth place here is not a good sign, but somebody, Diddy Kong, I think, getting hit with the blue shell, I missed yet another item, but we all get struck by lightning. All right, start drifting right about here. Another blue shell coming in. Two blue shells in one race and neither of them hitting me is something I'm not used to in this game. Got the bananas. Red shell is no problem. We're just gonna keep drifting and get into this final lap. Got it. Ooh, I almost drifted too soon for that one. But we made it work. Okay. Another banana. This banana is all over the place for this course right now. All right, so. As long as I can just keep my lead, we're golden. I do think that for the most part, the retro courses are a lot easier than the new courses for this game. I feel like there's a lot less of the crazy jumps, the Sandy flying, and just more about drifting and having good track control. And there we go, because we have good track control and all that kind of stuff, we are just able to win as Toad is celebrating. 57 points in total is all we need to get the golden trophy here for this cup. So a few more exciting races under our belt. 
as you can see, we were really head to head against Princess Peach and uh, Dry Bones were our main competition here. But we found a way to get the victories for three out of four of them. Princess Peach sort of took that first one, but that's fine, because it's still a win for us, and it should still be at least one start, if I'm not mistaken. So happy about that, but let's take a look at the winner's podium. We're at the top yet again. Toad looks so tiny up there somehow. Even though he's the highest up, he still seemed to be the shortest one. <laughs> you got first place. Awesome. Here in the Shell Cup. We got the star rank as well. So there we go. Really nice stuff. Our first retro cup here in 150cc, but not the last for today. We're heading right back in with uh, Toad. We'll do a different cart this time for sure. Or bike, whichever works out. But Toad is going back in. And what do we want to do? Oh, the mini beast looks so cool. I might have to try something like this. We got either the mini beast or the bit bike. This is cool. We got the bullet bike as well. Mm, so many good choices here. I think Toad looks the coolest on which one. I don't know. And I could also do this cheap charger. So many good options here. I think I like the bit bike. Hopefully we actually do well with this as we head into the Banana Cup with Sherbert Land, Shy Guy Beach, Delfino Square, and Waluigi Stadium. So Sherbert Land is our first one. This one, I don't know what kind of drifting this bike has, this bit bike, so we'll have to wait and see. But I think no matter what, with a wider open track like this, we should be able to handle it. Okay. We're drifting. No, we're not. <laughs> okay, it definitely is just a normal drifting bike. So all the way back in 12th. Not a good start at all. Uh oh. <laughs> really not a good start. I've never been this far back. I'm caught up to make it a win, but maybe we can Make it happen. Let's get the superstar here, and I'm just gonna charge through. I think the superstar also eliminates our bad traction with the ice, but I might be wrong. Bull Bill, what, where are you going? Okay, uh, hi guys, watch out! Oh, come on, charge through him, there you go. Okay, with that, we get back up to fifth, which is better than nothing, but there's still so much more to get through. Can you move? Get out of here with that. All right, come on. I'm back in eighth, but at least we're back with the pack, and I missed the items when I really could've used them. Definitely a weird experience so far, but I just want to, ow, get back to the front. I can't imagine our second lap would be any worse than our first. Give me that item, we're in sixth place now. I get the triple red shells, which I'll definitely be using. Right about here, boom, no, okay, cool. Come on, one of those should have gone for DK. Got the banana right here, let's get back to drifting. Yeah, <laughs> I replaced his banana with my own. Don't hit me with that, don't do it. Okay, Luigi gets zapped. I'm still racing with DK, just barely, just barely slipping in between all of that stuff. There we go, somebody's gonna get hit by that. Nice, Waluigi did. So that will help me get a little bit more of a lead here, which I really need, especially if I'm gonna miss all my stinking items. Got it. Wheeling through all of this. I just need to rely on the wheelie a little bit more. Go. Ah, uh, not good. Not good, oh, okay, just jumped over the corner. That could have been a disaster. Got it. Come on, keep it moving, keep it moving. Ah, oh, not quite. Come on. Jumping over here. Just gotta get through all this. All right. Uh, trying to be careful where I can. Ow. Just gonna put that banana down. Cause somehow, despite all of this, I have a good lead. I've been so focused in on just making things work that I didn't even really realize. But there we go, yeah, with a significant lead here, we get a win. That's great. It was an awful, awful start, but a first place finish is all we really need. So 15 points for the first race of this cup. Can we keep things going here in the Banana Cup? We'll have to wait and see. 
Shy Guy Beach is our next one. I mean, the last time we rushed through this, it was with a bike, because it was 100cc. If we could do it then, we can do it now, right? Sure hope so. All right, Toad, are you ready? Got a decent start, but then immediately get pushed around by just about everybody. A big downside to the lightweight characters. I feel like I know the most efficient way to get through this though, so as long as I could just get ahead a little bit, I can probably keep the lead, as long as no crazy item stuff happens, but we'll have to wait and see. Gonna grab another item right there, try to jump over the water. Okay, so, throw out that one red shell. That wasn't so bad, see I'm catching up a lot with that. The red shell hit the umbrella. Huh, it's no item right now. Gotta use that against the Koopa, so it's definitely a shame. Oh, I get the huge slipstream boost by hanging out behind you. Okay, the cannonballs are going a little crazy. Come on. Very hard to dodge stuff with a bike. Okay, okay, get out of here. Come on, I keep trying to just barely sneak around them and it's just not going very well for me. I'm just gonna use this to speed through here. And then just try to wheelie through this part. Works out decently well. Final lap now. This track is so, so fast. Come on, dude, get out of the way. The worst. We're in third place now, fourth place. They're all taking this path. Can the crabs chill out? Blue Shell coming in. I don't know how many Blue Shells we've really thrown in this series so far, so that at least feels satisfying. It hit the Koopa, so we're back in third. If I could just not get exploded, that's great. I really prefer it when I don't get exploded. If I just wheelie through this part, I think we got it. Somehow, someway, I pulled out the win. Oh man, what a race. There's so much crazy stuff happening. We get the 15 points we need to move on to the next race. So Delfino Square. We know all about this track. And it's one we pretty consistently win at. So let's see if we can't keep that consistency going strong. All right, dude, we got this. Decent little wheelie here. And, got it. It's always the first few turns that I feel like can sometimes be the most crucial for determining where we end up by the end of the race, but who knows, maybe not. I say that, but then at the same time, we still won at Trubert Land. And we started off as awful as it could be. So, Mario Kart's a little bit of a different beast when it comes to racing. No race is truly over until it's over. What do I get here? Oh, you know what? Oh, oh, that would have been so cool. I've never actually pulled that shortcut off. It's okay. It was a good try. I can still plop down here and grab something. I get the lightning. You know what? Let's do it. There you go. Zap everybody down. Now I can cruise over, I get the golden mushroom, which I will just use straight away here, just to boost through this whole situation. See you guys, see you, give me that first place, give me that first place, come on, there it is. Awesome, back to where we're supposed to be for the second lap. But, there's still more to get through here. Oh man, watch it. Holding out the banana. Okay. <laughs> That was an impressive throw, for sure. But, ow. I'm still a little offended by it. What do we get this time? Triple banana, not gonna try any kind of crazy mushroom stuff then. Let's keep it moving, can I squish you? Not quite. Catching up the Koopa slowly but surely. But, ow, ooh, can I get that? Thank you. That actually worked out in my favor then, cool. And I get another triple banana for my troubles. Oh, there was another mushroom on the ground there. I guess from the, the lightning. Ooh, lots of bananas scattered everywhere now as we head into the last lap. I just need to wheelie through this. We're in the lead for now, but how long can we keep it? 
Alright, get him through. And I can do one more drift like that. Then over here, just gonna put this down immediately. That would have been so upsetting if that hit me. It bounced right over Toad's head. Very, very lucky. Um, okay, I got another one right there. Just trying to make the absolute most of my wheelies and drifts wherever I can. Ah, uh, I get zapped again. Come on, come on. Ow, really? Why does that remove my item, you know? It doesn't feel quite fair in that way. We're in fifth place, which is really not where I need to be for this. We got a giant Waluigi as if he's not big enough already. Come on, come on. If I just drift through like that and then I just speed boost like this, I might be able to get a slipstream and steal a second. I mean, now out of the whole situation there, second place isn't too bad. 42 points in total. If we move towards this last one, we should be fine. So Waluigi Stadium. Waluigi is gonna be extra bad on his own home course because he almost got the second place there, but I just barely snagged it from him. So let's see what we can do now. All right. Just really focused in on getting a good race here. I wanna win this cup, get the one star finish. Ow, come on. No matter how focused I am, it doesn't magically give me an item now, so that's the problem. I guess we're getting up there. They sort of pushed me up there. So far, this has been one of the hardest Mario Kart games to get everything now. It just, it's so hectic. The enemies just give you so much grief. Oh, but a superstar? Don't mind if I do. Love to charge through all this stuff. Maybe hit a couple of the players. I got Luigi. I'm catching up a bit. Ow, and I get zapped again. Let a couple of people pass me, sure, right before I get the item. That way I can guarantee something nice here. Sipping through this as fast as I can, but could have been better. Okay, getting more stuff there. What do I get this time? It is triple red shell. I'll throw them out where I can, but right into the fireball. Come on. Okay, cut the corner pretty well there, but that doesn't matter if just a superstar just runs through. I get that item somehow. Gold mushroom. Don't hit the banana. Get out of here. Going through, going through, going through. Don't hit the, the fireball. I snag a first place. Come on. Nice. And then do a trick off of this one. And this one. Oh, the pow block though. Showing up the worst. I mean, the Waluigi. Why did the push me into the dirt? Come on. Not able to get the item. DK grabs it and he makes me pay for it. Jeez. Get an item there, though. What's it gonna be this time? Red Shell. It, why did it do that? It just ran straight into the wall. I think Waluigi Stadium's a little rigged. I was trying to throw the at Waluigi. All right, not good, not good. I was supposed to get an item out of that jump. Don't hit the fake one. That was actually a really well placed. Fake item block by a computer. Usually they don't do that. Okay, come on. Throw that one at Waluigi. It actually hits him this time. Maybe it isn't rigged. Come on, here's my chance to snag first place with DK right behind me though. He's not happy about it. I don't think I'm gonna do the jump off of this. I think the turn angle would have been way more important if I still got the item. Come on, come on, we can still do it. I'm all over the place, but if I can just wheelie, I think we're fine. First place finish. Whew. 15 more points solidifies our victory for sure. Only one second place finish there isn't so bad. So for the second time with Toad, we had some intense retro cup races. But hey, DK and Koopa couldn't keep up by the end of it all especially with this really cool bike. It looks like it, the top three finishes are all bikes. Wasn't expecting that. But it looks like another win for Toad. Bringing it home for the Mushroom Kingdom. So let's see you one more time on top of that podium. All right. 
So doing his little happy dance, we get ourselves the Golden Banana Trophy. First place, and just an A rank, no! We got like three first places though. I don't know why it was just an A rank. That's sort of a shame. Well, unfortunately that means I'm gonna have to replay it, but in the meantime, congratulations, you can now play the 150cc Leaf Cup. So I guess we're not quite done. I need to run back in there and get that done again. I'll probably do it with a bike this time, or a cart this time, just to get it out of the way. All right, so this time I got the two stars. That was really good, really happy to get that. And we don't unlock anything this time, but it was still worthwhile to do. Okay, it takes so long to load this. But yeah, we got two stars there. That should be good enough because we just need one star for each cup. So we'll get two more cups done, of course, in the next episode of Mario Kart Wii. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.